Hello friends, welcome back to Technique. Today we will be doing the performance testing of the newly launched Vivo X200. Now the Vivo X200 comes with uh, the Dimensity 9400 chip and uh, you get a really powerful hardware uh, in the form of 12GB RAM and uh, you also get UFS 4.0 and LPDDR5X RAM and then uh, you also get uh, the Android 15 out of the box. So those are the features available on the Vivo X200. It's a really flagship grid device. The Dimensity 9400 is a really powerful chip. So let's see how it performs. So right now we have 93% battery remaining and let's check the temperature so 33 degrees the room temperature let's start uh, the performance testing of this device so first will be cpu throttling test so right now we have opened uh, the uh, cpu throttling test and let's uh, see the test here so options 15 uh, uh, threads or rather the 20 threads and 15 minutes is the value so let's start the test So now you can see that uh, we are done with uh, uh, the performance testing. CPU throttled to 65% of its max performance. So moreover, it's kind of stable experience. It's not very radical. It's more or less like stable, but 65% throttling happened. It uh, throttled to 65% of its max performance. And let's also check uh, the temperature after the testing. So it's not that high, 40 degrees. Started off around 30 three degrees and it went up to 40 degrees and you can see almost close to 10 percentage uh, battery drain after the uh, cpu throttling test the 15 minute cpu throttling test next let's go to the stress test so next let's go with uh, the wildlife uh, 3d mark wildlife extreme stress test it's a 20 loop test and let's see how good the performance is so let's start the wildlife extreme stress test Now we completed the stress test and you can see here the stability is 67.4 is the stability the best loop score is 55858 uh, and the lowest loop score is 3749 so 67.4 is the stability and you can see here the performance range and the battery went down from 82 percentage to 70 percentage that's 12 uh, percentage drop and again temperature was well under control you can see that uh, it went only up to 43 so thermals are well managed here so you don't see any sort of overheating the thermals are done really well even in the stress testing you can see the maximum temperature was 43 degrees and the battery drain was around 12 percentage and you can see here frame rate 16 fps to 38 fps and you can see the battery and frame rate uh, uh, plotted against the chart so that was the loop score uh, the stability is 67.4 percentage next let's see the antitube benchmark test so you can see here 23 lakh 13,695 is the antitube score uh, in fact some of the testing uh, got around closer to 30 lakh on uh, the dimensity 9400 but we have the score which we have got here so you can see here the cpu score the gpu score uh, the uh, and uh, the memory and the ux score for this device so you can see here really powerful device in terms of anti to benchmark let's also test the storage and if you look at the the storage test uh, around 2 lakh 3877 is the uh, you can see here ufs 4.0 and lpddf 5x ram and finally let's go to the geekbench test and again here you can see here the geekbench results 2197 is a single core score and multi core score is 6943 that's what we got we tested multiple times and we this is the score we got on the vivo x200 so that is the performance testing of the vivo x200 so overall we would say it's a really good flagship device uh, in terms of the cpu throttling test uh, 65 percentage is in bad actually uh, it's more or less a kind of stable performance uh, not a very erratic and even the stability score is quite okay i would say now the uh, benchmark score is very good uh, in terms of attitude score the storage test and the geekbench score also looks good so that was a performance testing and overall we would say there was no heating issues as such the thermals are really controlled well and battery drain was around 12% uh, uh, for the stress test and around 10% for the CPU throttling test. So hope you enjoyed watching this video do hit that like button and also hit the subscribe button for more videos. Thanks for watching hope to see you in our next video have a great day.